Confetti collapsing, fantastic. Now pump the treble. Think I got the top of the tip of my tongue and Oh! <laughs> is that double time or is that just 30 second notes? Yo, and welcome back to another Honest Take. Today we're going to be reacting to The Hunger by Ren. And this is the third installment of a four part series of getting to know who Ren is. Unfortunately, I watched the last one first. So this will be the last one in our series. But it was almost it was almost interesting watching the last one first because it, it almost allowed me to put things together and put pieces together that I wouldn't have been able to had I watched them one through four. For instance, the uh, pig on a stick. But uh, yeah, let's dive into it. All right. So right off, I mean, we see the Lord of the Flies reference. And if you're not familiar with that, halfway through the book when all the kids start going nuts, one of them goes off, climbs up a mountain, and for some reason they, he finds a pig's head on a stick, and there are all these flies, and then the flies create this, this look like the mouth of the pig is talking, and it, it acts as like the mental breakdown of this kid. And he has a psychotic episode, right? So maybe this song has to do with the psychotic break because I know he did have one because he talks about his psychosis. But here we go. Poison in my veins lights a flame in my brain that maintains the pain that may change my frame of mind. Blind at design rhymes intertwined double time genuine Frankenstein I made it. Nice. That was really cool how he... Uh... <laughs> He did like that magic trick. He did a little kids, but he's also like keeping in the ticks and the, the, the twitches and the, so this must have to do with the psychotic episode. Monster. Conquer. Music scene. Golden ticket. Wonka. Conjure. Lyrics in my belly. I got thunder. Younger. Everybody wishes they were younger. The older I'm getting, the more I feel the hunger. About to like a welterweight. How to scout to need alpha cells. Alpha beta delta. I help you into the fall. I shall come out to mind. The TV, these rhymes. I'm a fine genet. I felt a feeling like this feeling. Me believing I'm a demon. I'm a devil. Fuck the game. Completed every level. I'm a vessel. For spirits of Chandler. I'm a lyrics. I'm a rebel. I break. Whoa, he's doing really weird stuff with his voice. He's like partially singing, yodeling. He's doing that bard stuff. I'm going to rewind it 15 seconds just to hear that whole opening thing again. Bouncing like a welterweight, helter-skelter. I, I thought you couldn't even say those words, helter-skelter. That gets, uh, that usually gets censored. Fallout shelter. Stop it, dude. So good. Whoa. Is that double time or is that just 30 second notes? It was powerful. Let's rewind that so I can hear it one more time. Awesome. I got goosebumps. A Toblerone? What the hell is a Toblerone? I gotta look that word up later. <laughs> this is a Toblerone. It's uh it's like a Snickers bar. Throwing the flow and then growing up when I swallow the flow like a Toblerone. Bro! So good! Up and I'm taking it low. Kid with the black heart in the car park by Primal Jamming Django, one heart, living with a bro star, refine rats, we'll find our Vincent Van Gogh. I start making my mark like Frankie Sonar. Truck can call me Arthur. And my style is home. Bro, th this is like the fifth flow. And it's different from the illest of our time because I've already seen the illest of our time. How. How many types of flow has he mastered? Don't like growing Cali weed. Don't need no personal trainer. I got trainers on my feet. You know I got the soul in my bowl when I eat. You know I'm staying grounded when I grind up my beef. But if you got a problem, my brother, I might just put on some rubber gloves and just choke it to Larry's rub to some blood that just bubbles up and the bubbles just double up and you struggle. But lucky suckers, I'm subtle at covering up the trouble. 
cover up the crime scene 1990 that's my scene my teen years were spent rolling the tight green obscene fiend in a pair of baggy jeans putting backy with the green roll of fatty dopamine starts flowing my cerebellum glowing the pendulum is slowing i'm swinging and i'm swaying but i don't know where i'm going mind running jesse owens hallelujah leonard cohen all the seeds that i've been sowing slowly growing like trees i grow then i preach scrap that i teach teach over beats to all those that seek Teach on these streets. Streets can be bleak, but bleak was the place where I rose to my feet. Oh my gosh, another flow. Holy cow. And the beat's really not changing that much. I mean, it's the same. It's the same outside of like the space he's rapping in between. I mean, Mozart said that music spoke in between the notes. So I guess that makes sense. But like the overall, like, you know, the meter, it's, it's been the same the whole time. And it sounds like he's sung like five or six different songs. This is... This guy just keeps surprising me, man. It's crazy. I've been sitting here for about 10 minutes trying to figure out what this song could or couldn't mean. And I know you guys always tell me to figure, like, don't try to figure out Ren. It's not possible, but I can't help it. I have to try and make some sense of it because otherwise I go insane. So we got the Lord of the Flies reference. The monster is coming out. He's now one with the monster. And once the monster comes out, that's where he starts just going from flow to flow to flow to flow. And it's just like top shelf, God tier flow. And that would make sense because this song goes into the illest of our time where he's basically looking at the camera the whole time like, yeah, I am the best. Oh, that's what it is. And then in the illest of our time, all those other monsters show up. And are those all the other flows he has? Like, is he just saying that like each monster or beast in that video is a type of flow that he's... He's basically mastered? Is is that it? I don't know, guys. What do you think? The song was dope. I love the beat. Uh, the wordplay, superb as always. Um, if you have any theories on what the song may or may not mean, uh, put it in the comment section down below. Argue with me. I love to hear your thoughts. And uh, let's, uh, let's try to figure out what this is. And let's try to figure out what's going on in this. As always, guys, if you like the reaction, please like, share, and subscribe. Uh, and if you don't, as always... You can fuck off. <laughs> Peace.